2020, that is when St. Pete will start writing tickets for restaurants who give out plastic straws. City Council voting to ban plastic straws despite opposition from business owners. ABC Action News reporter Jake Peterson is live on Central Avenue. And Jake, how much are these people going to get fined? Hey, good morning to you. Well, it's 40 for the first violation, 80 for the second, and so on. Now, some businesses, like the Cider Press Cafe here on uh, Central Avenue, they're already in compliance. They have nothing to worry about. They already switched to those paper straws, but others, they still have some time to meet the requirements. Here's the timeline. Between January and March of 2019, the city won't do anything. They're letting businesses have an adjustment period. But then in April, warnings will start going out to business owners who haven't switched to paper. But here's the big one. The fine start at the beginning of 2020. Business owners say the paper straws are much more expensive to order, but those in favor of the ban say it's good for the environment. If we can just do that one small little step of eliminating some kind of single-use plastic, why not do it? Most people still want their straws. That's what we found out. I asked them about paper straws and they said no, they don't like them. The City Council will have a compliance officer checking in with all businesses starting next year to help them if there are any questions before the fines go into place. Next year, the city will also start considering a ban on styrofoam cups and to-go containers.